What's up, you whack hacks? Hey, let's make up a 20 amp receptacle device using 12.2 coming in, coming out. Secure your single gang nail on with that climb hammer. Make sure those tabs are sticking out a half inch so your box doesn't get buried by the drywall. Next, we're gonna go ahead and run the cable into the box. This is the power coming in. Label it if you need to. If not, don't worry about it. And for all you apprentices out there, I want you to start bringing that incoming power to the left side of the box and the outgoing power to the right side of the box. Make sure you get your proper cable length. Measure up eight inches and put a mark. And make sure you staple those conductors an inch and a quarter back so you don't have to use a 16th of an inch steel plate. Then we're gonna use our razor blade. Go ahead and slit the top and the bottom. Remove the outer sheathing. The sharper the blade, the better for me. Go ahead and remove that inner sheathing as well. Train all your wires to the bottom left corner. Put your strippers in, cut them, gives you about 10 inches. Use that extra wires jumpers. Go ahead and remove about an inch of length of sheathing. Start with the bare equipment grounds, put them all together, tuck them in the right side of the corner. Then we're gonna jump to the white neutrals, put that tan wire nut on, and you can finish it with the nut blaster. Tuck those to the left side. Then we're gonna put the hots in the center, and I'm gonna make sure that I pre-twist these wires nice and tight. Finish off with the nut blaster. Fold your wires up, go ahead and give them a trim. Get that 15 amp receptacle out of here. Give me a 20 amp, thank you. Let's go ahead and hook this up by stripping and curling all the conductors first. And then we're gonna start with the ground, wrap it around the green ground screw with that square one bit. Then we're gonna move to the silver neutral, tuck that around, gold black. And guys, make sure you put some tape around it. Let's go.